The only way to spend any time alone together these days is in the office. Yes, but it is interesting. <laughs> at least we can have some privacy. Ray, mm -hmm. honey, I have an appointment at two. I want to have lunch first and I don't want to... See, I show you affection and you think about work. It's not my fault we don't spend any time together. You are a workaholic, Miranda. Me? Yes. In fact, you have such a full diary, you don't even have time to enjoy life. That's not true. I enjoy... Yes, it is. You are an ambitious achiever, and job satisfaction is important to you. But remember, the human factor is important, too. Thanks, hon. I come here to relax and see my husband, and instead I feel like one of your patients. I care about your well-being. And I suggest you eat better, too. Oh, Ray, please don't start. Stress causes people to eat unhealthy food. I like unhealthy food. Eating is one of life's greatest pleasures. And eating food I like is important too, isn't it, doctor? Of course. Everything we eat has a certain vibration. And if we eat things that aren't in harmony with us, our bodies don't get the energy they need. Do you know what my body needs right now? Some Scottish rock oysters. Accompanied by a chilled glass of Chardonnay? You got it. Hello again. Time for our workout. We all know that our diet is very important, but I have to agree with Miranda. Eating is one of life's greatest pleasures, so we have to enjoy it too. Now to our health and body care session. Ray is a doctor, and he knows the benefits of a healthy diet and eating healthy food. That is food that's good for you and also gives you the energy you need for your busy lifestyle. Stress causes people to eat unhealthy food. So although it may be food we like and it lifts our morale, makes us feel good and relaxed, it can also have negative effects. Not only on our physical well-being, because it's not good for us, but it can have negative psychological effects as well. How many of us eat our favorite food, like chips or cake, and then feel guilty? Because we know it's bad for us, and we shouldn't eat it, but we eat it anyway. I, for one, love fish and chips, but I know fried food is unhealthy. However, when I'm stressed, or I don't have time to cook, I often have fish and chips for lunch, and then feel very guilty because I know I know I shouldn't have eaten them. It's better to have a healthy chicken salad or even a sandwich. Of course, Miranda knows all of this. Ray probably often reminds her to eat well because she says, Ray, please don't start. It seems as though she hears it a lot, but it's just because he loves her and cares about her well-being. She's certainly very busy. She has a full diary, lots of appointments, and things to do. In fact, Ray calls her a workaholic, which means she works too much. She's an ambitious achiever. She wants to be successful in her career, but Ray thinks she doesn't have time to enjoy life, which isn't good. We have to enjoy life and relax from time to time. Don't forget, that's healthy too. So take your time, have a rest, but don't forget to practice your English. I'll meet you in the next session. Bye.